Welcome to Idol Talk. I'm Amanda Winkle. I'm Katie Fry. And last week we lost a couple people, so we are down to the top 20. We lost Janelle, we lost Tyler, we lost Joe, and we lost Ashley. So boohoo is sad, but we're getting closer to our top 12, so we are psyched for that. Um, Katie, you had a lot to say about the guys' performances this week, right? There was a lot to say. We had a couple, only two really good standouts that we really were rooting for. The first one was Alex Lambert. Now, he kind of crashed and burned last week, but the judges really rooted for him this week. They thought he had a huge improvement. He sang a song called Everybody Knows, and he sounded so good. You couldn't really help but watch him. He was so sincere about what he was seeing. So he was definitely our favorite, unexpected favorite yeah. for this week. Yeah. He was really good. <laughs> um, the other person that we both are really starting to like a lot more is Lee. Lee. Um, he sang <laughs> Lips of an Angel and um, I wrote, he's cute because he looked really cute. And um, he looked really <laughs> comfortable. And Randy really liked it. Uh, Kara said it was a big improvement. And Simon actually said the big compliment of the night was vocally, you're above everybody else. Yeah. So he's definitely getting out there in popularity. He really looked like he was going to cry when Simon told him that. I know, just relief. But he, he was really into his performance and that's what makes people want to watch him. Do we have any other peeps that were like okay but not um not not necessarily um we had two that weren't good uh big time i think big mike is notable only because he's saying a song called it's a man's world and um, it was okay like the judges aren't really impressed with his song choice i think he can really step it up a notch because he can do a lot a lot better yes go big mike keep getting better and on Wednesday night, we had the girls performing, and the girls went second instead of first because Crystal Bowersock, she was in the hospital. Yeah. Um, but she fought back. She came back strong. She did um, a CCR song, and it was really good. She just, like, knocked it out of the park. Mm -hmm. She sang with her guitar. It was awesome. And Siobhan, who was my favorite last week, she was my second favorite this week. Um, she sang uh, Think by Aretha Franklin, and she had this killer note at the end. It was like, ah! Like, I was like, holy crap. A crowd pleaser. From? Yeah. So that was really cool. Um, some other ones that were in, your girl Haley, and I wasn't, you know, she was yeah. she was okay. That She was in my okay list. Um, she sang The Climb from oh, yeah. Miley Cyrus, yeah. Hannah Montana. <laughs> Love that song. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She did okay, though, but the judges were like, oh, you need another year to develop your talent. And I was like, well, why did you send her along then if yeah. she needs another year to develop? A little too late. Um, and then another one that was okay for me was uh, Michelle Delamore. She sang with Arms Wide Open by Creed, and it was kind of an atypical song choice for her. So I thought that was cool that she, you know, picked something she could put her heart into. Yeah. And now it's time to talk about the not-so-bright spots of both nights. Um, okay, for the boys, Katie, you want to talk about who we did not Oh yeah, at all? We agreed, which is rare, 100% <laughs> on these people. Todrick Hall, um, totally missed the mark. Tina Turner, he did What's Love, got to do with it. Randy was was really funny. He just said, you just need to sing a nice song. Because he, he just going too much out of the box with this, and he just needs to sing and sing. That's it. Um, Simon was just just really upset he said you you're just getting this wrong so we really think he dropped the ball he's in danger of going home the second person Jermaine Sellers uh he's saying what's going on um he had some questionable wardrobe choices uh, <laughs> uh yeah. and he he was off last night um he pushed too hard um the judges said uh, he was doing too much and um Simon said nobody can take you seriously because his runs were all over the place and he was trying to jazz up everything to where it just was annoying he just kept going back and forth with the judges too much too it's yeah. like dude don't, you know just don't take debate the judges yeah it's so. just like okay whatever so we think those two guys are going home yeah now for the girls um here's who we think are going home uh, we think Dee Dee, I know she's one of your favorites, but she I'm is. sorry, she sang, uh, oh gosh, it was, it was just bad, not good. Um, and then Paige, she did the cardinal sin that you do not like. She sang Walk Away by Kelly Clarkson. You don't do that, people. Stop singing American Idol songs. And she was the original, so you just need a lot know, to look you, up to. You just cannot be Kelly, so that's our picks. Uh, we think Dee Dee and Paige for the girls. Hopefully we'll get more right this week than we did last week. We only yeah. got one out of four. Yeah. Um, but tell us who you think is going home. Go to jacksonville.com slash entertainment slash idol and vote in our poll. Tell us which guys and girls you think are going home. Have a good week. Bye. Bye.